Sometimes it can seem that the industry we watch addicts love so much suffers an acute case of no sense of humoritis. So colour us surprised when one of the most serious brands around, Audemars Piguet, has an extra thin and compact watch that is nicknamed Jumbo. You can also get your very own matching cufflinks. The Audemars Piguet Royal Oak has so much prestige and an amazing backstory, one that we have covered many times before, but none of them have such an unusual nickname. So where does it come from? And what makes this particular Royal Oak so special? Let's find out. If you like our content, we would so appreciate it if you could like and subscribe. Drop us a comment too. The team here at Time Only love reading your thoughts. As mentioned, we've covered Audemars Piguet a few times on our channel, and at the end of this review, we'll have a shortcut to the playlist of all of those videos. But today we're here to talk Jumbo. When the Royal Oak was released in 1972, there were a few things about it that created ripples. It was only available in steel, and it was a rather large 39mm case diameter. This earned it the nickname Jumbo. In this day and age, the average watch is probably around 40 to 42mm diameter size, which is very different from our parents or grandparents' watches, that would be more likely to be around 34 to 36mm diameter so it's not hard to imagine the reactions to a rather brutal, large steel watch. Over the last year or two, watch brands have been releasing watches around the 38mm diameter again, to cater for smaller wrists and tastes, so you could say that the Jumbo is more fashionable than ever. So, are there any other clues to the unique Royal Oak model on yours or someone else's wrist? Yes, there are, and we're going to show you how to identify it. We have the standard integrated bracelet, no less beautiful and precision made than usual. Again, this was one of the first watches that featured an integrated bracelet, and one could argue that it's still the best looking bracelet around. We have the bezel with its octagonal screws present, inspired by a ship's porthole, and the signed bolt-like crown, more classic design cues that make this one of the most desirable watches in the world. Covering the beautiful dial with its petite tapisserie pattern is a sapphire crystal with anti-glare treatment, which ensures you won't spend every minute of every day touching that intricate dial. It's also the dial where we can find a clue to this being the Jumbo. It's the AP logo at 6 o'clock. On other iterations of the Royal Oak, you'll find the logo above the brand name and located just beneath the 12 o'clock position. It's a small detail, but we feel it really fits well down there at 6. The movements are always special to look at on the Royal Oak, and the calibre 2121 is no exception. It has 36 joules and a power reserve of 40 hours. It's self-winding and has to us one of the most beautiful decorated rotors around. It would be a bit weird to remove your watch to show strangers your fancy movement, but we wouldn't put it past anyone. There is a perfectly acceptable water resistance of 50 metres, and enough loom to be visible in the dark, so there's no need to feel like you're compromising on either of these departments. If your wrists are slightly more slender, or if you simply want to own the model that's closest to the original release, you would do well to be looking at the Royal Oak Jumbo. It's also reasonably affordable still, but we are quite sure that these will appreciate over time. When we occasionally source the Jumbo for our customers, they don't last long before they're gone. We love this little watch, is one of the best looking Royal Oak models available, and every time it crosses our desks on its way to a customer, we think, one day I'm getting my own. When you're ready to obtain your own Royal Oak, reach out to us here at Time Only. Thanks for watching, and we look forward to bringing you more about time next time.